Hello everybody, and thanks for joining us for another Whitfield's Food Review. It's the exact same day as the pork one, and the same day as the other Taco Bell item. Lots of stuff came out today. We found this by accident. I was actually just thinking about getting Taco Bell for dinner, and I was like, what the hell was that? What the hell that was, was another Carolina Reaper item. We just reviewed a Carolina Reaper slushy hmm. from... I wonder if that's just in right it, now. It's gotta be, it's the hot thing. A couple years ago, it was like habanero, it was a goose yeah. pepper, and now it's Reaper. We've never had great luck with the fries. These look good. Yeah. And it's big, it's like 350 for this, and we also got the burrito, but that's gonna be in a video uploaded immediately afterwards. Cause we're, we're starting to learn how to do this YouTube thing. <laughs> I'm actually I'm excited. excited about this. Sauce on it. That's the That's Reaper, Reaper sauce, sauce, I'm guessing. Cheese, sauce, sour cream, tomatoes. Um, and, and some, some steak. steak. So let's try this. And it's a beautiful rainy day in Florida. And I'm not even joking. I love the rainy days. It is hot. I hope it's hot like this Reaper. We need any sauce. We wanted to enjoy the Reaper as it is. Grillers were actually kind of hot. The ghost pepper one, if you got it the right batch, was really hot. This isn't that hot? You're not making any wincing sounds? I don't hear any. It's hot. It's got some heat. It almost kind of tastes buffalo-ish to me. It looks buffalo-ish. It has like a buffalo taste a little bit. I think it's really good though. If you want something hot, but you don't want it to be way too hot, I think that's good. Oh, the heat is nice. Yeah, it's not like over the top and it still tastes good. But we complained that the Reaper um, margarita wasn't hot enough. Well, I don't think this is hot enough to... They said, they said it was like their hottest item ever. Well, not now. Nah. Honestly, them volcano tacos, they sound were hot to me, but... Does it taste buffalo -y to you? It tastes a lot like buffalo. That's kind of kind of wild, actually. I mean, honestly, I think it might be better with chicken. Because of the buffalo quality to it. Maybe. The sauce is very... There is a, there's a sting. No one can deliver that heat. It's like Taco Bell keeps saying they're they're putting out their hottest thing ever, yeah. and it's not as hot even as their volcano sauce was. It's not as hot as even the um, grillers were. They're not very hot. The ghost pepper griller, when you got it right, like because sometimes uh, like one section would be that hot, another mm -hmm. section would be like crazy hot. Those were good. That was like a ooh okay. I'm not getting that from this. I'm thinking oh okay, it's a little heat. It, you know, it, it just tastes like you put a little hot sauce on it. Not good flavor though. But it's very good flavor, and it's actually the best those fries I've ever tasted. It looks like they extra dusted them with some orange. Maybe they have. I don't know if that's some extra Reaper seasoning. Because ours has never looked like that before. No. That cheese sauce blends in with that Reaper sauce really well. And the sour cream and the tomatoes. It's all very good. Very good. Honestly, I, I'd be fine without a steak. My heat, 5 out of 10. You said yeah. 3 for the margarita. But uh, I think we... This tastes hotter than, to me. Okay, so we're the, gonna. Oh, the, the shake or the slushy burnt my throat. This one burns my my mouth a little bit more than my throat, so it's a different kind of heat to me. So five out of ten for the heat. So if you're not a, if you don't like heat, you're you're not gonna like yeah, these. You don't like it. If you like uh, mild heat, honestly, this is less hot than if you just ate a, a jalapeno. A raw oh, jalapeno yeah. okay, would yeah. burn the living day out of your mouth if you're not ready for it. This is way lower on the Scoville units, guaranteed. I have a four point eight. 4.8, yeah, you know what? That's oh, the highest score we've ever given the fries. It's because of, I don't think the fries are great. I just yeah, don't. I'm not a fan of the fries. But everything else is really good. And it's not, it's, I thought it's gonna be hotter, but it's hot enough for me. Like, like I think it's- Yeah, fine, it's enjoyable. I expect it to be hot, yeah. Hotter. Yeah, you get a, little, you get a little, little sting in the mouth, but a lot of flavor. Cold chicken they got now. Oh no, you gotta get the cubes. And if you get, if you order anything on the app, you can substitute that. They, ha they still have the cubes, the chicken, you know, mm. the little, you know, the, um, I don't even call it whatever. You know the the cube chicken. Get it on the app. You can just swap it out. It's free. So I don't know. A little, little tricky dicks in there, trying to get you <laughs> on that shredded crap. Anyway, guys, that's what we think. Let us know what you think in the comments below. Did you even know about these? I know it was a test market item last year, but I kind of forgot about them. Are you gonna run out there and get this? Are you gonna get the fries? Are you gonna get the thing that we're having on the next video, the burrito, which I believe has fries in it anyway. So yeah, I'm curious how that's gonna work. Anyway, guys, put your comments below. Hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button. Hit that notification button. Like I said, we've only had 15% of our... What the hell's on my face? <laughs> I just... <laughs> okay. So, we only have 15% of the subscribers who've actually hit that notification button, guys. So, please do that. Otherwise, you'll probably have no idea we have all these videos coming out. Also, if you want to see our very first episode of Drunk Food... 
So every episode is a six pack of beer and us making something that most likely we have no business making. Eh, who cares, throw it in there. Mmm, look at that sizzle. <laughs> I've had three beers and three shots, so I think I'm of sound mind to improvise this. So much wrong. <laughs> This is only funny after three beers, so I hope you've had three beers as well. I don't know. Well, thank you, Jennifer. Remember pretzels at the ballpark? They look just like that. Uh. <laughs> That's so hot. It's mm. so hot, literally. Go head over to our Patreon as well as Rockfin, and I. Those things are a blast. It's beer and cooking, and I hope you guys enjoy it. So thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and all those. Have an angel next time.